Hi, darlings. How are you? This is going to be for my Aries, and this is going to be for the week of the 9th through the 15th of April. I will be using my Affirmators Tarot deck, and to clarify, I will be using Learning Tarot Cards. So, let's see. So Aries, this is for you. The Hanged Man. Got a decision to make, you can't make it. The Queen of Cups, this might be an energy in your environment. Pisces, a Scorpio or a Cancer. Or this could be you feeling kind of emotional right now and kind of sensitive. The chariot, I see something coming fast, or something came pretty fast, not too long ago. The world, whatever came, possibly came full circle. You attained your goals. The ten of pentacles. Unexpected income. Maybe inheritance or something, some money coming your way. Maybe lottery. Never know. Strength. You got a lot of inner strength. Could be a new job also. The Six of Swords. You're going to move to calmer waters. Or transition. You know. Everything will become peaceful. The Three of Cups. Happiness. Celebration. And the King of Swords. This is a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius. Or you are thinking about going to tell someone a piece of your mind. You're about to communicate something very straightforward to someone. That's what you're thinking about doing. You're going to act in it. So let's see. The hanged man. <clears throat> the hanged man. Temperance. And the three of cups. Have patience. Or you had patience. And there was some kind of celebration. Some kind of reunion? You had a decision to make? Was it to go somewhere? And you probably did go. Whatever it was, you were able to balance the situation. On top of the Queen of um, Cups, that came, came the Hierophant and the Page of Swords. There's some kind of curiosity about this person. This person might be, you might be in some kind of committed relationship. It could be a marriage or it could just be a long-term relationship. But you're curious about something. You're waiting on some kind of news patiently. Keyword, patience is needed, okay? Whatever communication you're waiting on, just be patient. It's coming. Are you waiting for... Let's, let's keep going. I got the Six of Swords again. You got the Six of Swords here. Finding stability, relief. 
the king of cups you got the queen of cups here this could be you now feeling emotionally balanced or the king of cups could be an energy within your environment a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius. Oh, what am I saying? Yes, I'm right. Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. Yes. Sometimes I zone out. <laughs> oh. Okay. Whatever it was, it had something to do with a broken heart. I think you're getting over a broken heart. That's where your emotions, being sensitive and now being emotionally balanced. You're moving to calmer waters. You still remember the pain, but you're evaluating yourself. And probably forgiving yourself because you know, or forgive the person. You know, just to let it go. Whatever it is. Don't don't let stuff weigh you down. I know it seems so easy to say. But as time goes on, if we keep practicing it, it will get better. So judgment and the three of swords. So now the Ten of Pentacles. So I think what you attained is a little peace, peace of mind. I like decisions again. You got decisions to make. And you got some extra responsibility now. It could be, you know, too many thoughts. Could be you're all locked up inside, emotionally, mentally, stressed, worrying about things you can't fix. Why do that to yourself? Write it down. All the things that are on your mind right now, write it down. Solve the ones you can solve. And the ones you can't solve, psh, get rid of it. Stop worrying about things we can't take care of. You're putting your body under a lot of stress, you know? Unnecessary stress. The two of swords and the ten of... <clears throat> and the ten of um, wands. Now that was over the ten of pentacles. So maybe you have a decision to make about a job or some new financial op opportunity. Or maybe you came into some money. You know what I mean? There are so many possibilities. I see whatever it is that you're going to find your strength though, okay? You're going to find your strength. Got the magician and I got the empress. You will find your strength. You are the magician. The magician card says I have all the resources I need, inner and outer. You just need to believe it. And the Empress, connecting to the earth reminds you that abundance is unlimited. Maybe you need to go and step outside to get that little courage back. Spend some time outside and just quiet your mind. I think you're pretty magical right now. You got the strength card, the magician, and the empress. Things can go for you really, really good. Just remember, we have free will and we can change anything at any time. So the top of the six of swords comes the king of pentacles. And comes <clears throat> the high priestess. I like these cards. <laughs> um, just be patient with yourself. Things are going to come to fruition, okay? At 
this moment, just be trustworthy. Even if it's just to you, just trust you and use your intuition. You have that ability. Use your intuition. Okay. Then we got the three of cups and things. You're going to be moving to calmer waters. Don't know what this king of swords is about, but let's see. I got the ten of cups and the seven of wands. You will attain your happiness when you move on. When you realize the magic that's within you. And you will be above your challenges. You will stand your ground and you will start believing in yourself. Maybe this King of Swords got something to do with this marriage card or something. Or maybe what ended or what is moving you on. Maybe something broke your heart could have been a marriage. But this is the Ten of Cups and the Seven of Wands. Abundance is on its way. Okay. And let's see who this King of Swords is or what this energy is about. This energy is about a new beginning. You're going to communicate with someone about a new beginning. Good news. And then the Three of Pentacles. You're going to have, it's going to be, you're going to be part of a team. The universe is building something for you, okay? You just need to believe in yourself. You're going to become creative. You're going to become part of a community or part of a team. You just need to believe you're going to have a new beginning. I got the Ace of Wands and the Three of Pentacles. And this King of Swords might have something to do with it. If this is an actual energy in your environment. If not, it was due to your communication that got you where you're going. Or where you're headed. <laughs> I love you guys. You take care of yourselves. And I will chat with you soon, okay? Bye.